We begin with the start of a long probe into what caused the medical helicopter to fall from the sky in Delaware County. Good evening. I'm Siaf Lewis. Yuki and Jessica have the night off. We're now seeing the moment the helicopter crashed right in front of a church in Drexel Hill. A driveway camera from a nearby home shows the aircraft crashing to the ground. All four people on board, including an infant, survived. Tonight, the wreckage has been removed and transferred to a nearby facility. The National Transportation Safety Board says its investigation into the crash could take up to a year to complete. Meanwhile, the pilot of the chopper has been identified by family as Daniel Moore. He suffered serious injuries but is expected to recover from them. Avenue News reporter Alicia Roberts is live in Drexel Hill with more on the clues investigators are looking for to help them answer the many questions surrounding this crash. Good evening, Alicia. Good evening to you, Siapa. Right around 7.30, that helicopter left the site where it final landed here en route to Delaware, where officials begin the process of scrutinizing exactly what happened over the skies here in Drexel Hill. It sounded like something coming towards us, kind of like, like a boom, boom, boom. And then we hear the crash. 24 hours after a medical helicopter carrying four passengers, including a two month old baby, crashed in front of a Drexel Hill church, investigators began the task of methodically collecting information to help them figure out what went wrong. There are components on board that, that contain valuable data that we hope to capture and download. Officials from the FAA, NTSB, and the manufacturer will look at everything from weather reports and air traffic communication at a secure site in Delaware, a process likely to span one year. An experienced investigator with technical expertise should be able to find one or two pieces that may have caused the crash. All four people on board were taken to the hospital. Everyone was released except for the pilot, identified by family as Daniel Moore. I had a very brief meeting with the pilot today. His medical condition precludes him from speaking to us. As the helicopter was lifted from the place it came to its final landing, what will remain are these images of heroism. One of the neighbors were pulling the pilot out. Jewel Singles is one of several bystanders who ran toward the danger. I stayed with the medic who had the baby. Strangers now forever bonded by what happened here on Vermont Road. It's just people helping each other. And I talked to the family of Daniel Moore tonight. They say what happened here is a true miracle and that they are proud of their son, a military and commercial trained pilot. They say the family is now focused on his recovery. Reporting live in Drexel Hill, Alicia Roberts, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Thank you so much, Alicia.